Hello, and welcome to Geek Archaeologist. I'm Evan, and this is Brent. And we have a subject for you today. What is it? We're talking about dojo, as you can dojo. see. Dojo? Yeah. So you probably heard the term in anime and other places like that before, right? Hey, Joe, I have no dough. <laughs> Tell me about it. <laughs> so a dojo is often portrayed like this. It's a bunch of people in a large room, mm -hmm. and it's a... Uh, you often see it in martial arts, but mm -hmm. it's, a, it's sort of broader than that. It's any sort of physical training facility. So anywhere where you're using your body regularly to train for something. So not just martial, martial arts? Correct. So. Yeah, not just martial arts. It could be anything from um, just regular physical exercise. It could be archery, all sorts of things like that. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wrestling? Mm-hmm, definitely. How about artists? Can, is there Probably a painting? Probably not, no, because it's not very physical. Meditators, right. yoga? Well, there, um, there are Zen Buddhist meditation halls that are called dojo, but the more accurate term is called zendo. 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 I see right. some similarities there. Yeah. Dojo and zendo. Right. Well, Zen, yep. I suppose, is the, what they're studying, mm -hmm. so it's zendo. What does dojo really mean? Well, that's the thing. We, we've heard about kendo and aikido. Mm -hmm. They end in do, right? Do means the way. The way. So um, Aikido is a particular way. Kendo is a particular way. Hmm. Um, so Do is way, and Jo is simply a place. So Dojo is the place where you practice that, that way, that particular method. Oh, wow. Yeah. So it, it all makes sense that way. Zendo. <laughs> the place where Zen is the way that they practice. Exactly. Hmm. Yeah. So, so all sorts of activities can go on in these dojos. Exactly. Dojo is the more f generalized term and then if you have a specific art that may be modified for that specific art. It can be, um, but, but generally speaking you know, when you're talking about a dojo you're talking about some kind of physical activity. So that, that's really where, where it's, it's used. Uh, and it's usually this large open room and we're used mm. to seeing that in you know, anime and and especially martial arts films and the such. big building everybody collects in for the totally, yeah. The, the, the training session with the master. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And um, uh, so you get, you get this huge space. Interestingly, in the old days, the, um, and even up to today sometimes, um, there are different entrances for different people. So oh. there'll be one entrance for senior students, one enter, entrance for junior students. And so you enter and exit in, in particular places. Well, just coming and going could be an honorific uh, experience there. Absolutely. Imagine that. <laughs> 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 totally. Uh, now, in the old days, um, the, the dojo was not necessarily used for training every day. The dojo was more of a formal place for certain exhibitions. Uh, we've all seen those old martial arts movies, like the old Jackie Chan movies, <laughs> where they're all out um, in, in the yard outside practicing there. Because the dojo would actually, of course, that's Chinese, but um, the dojo was actually used just for special occasions. Uh -huh. All you kids, go play in the yard. <laughs> this is where the masters are meeting. <laughs> Absolutely, yes. And speaking of the masters, uh, the, the other interesting thing is that the students are the ones expected to, to keep up the dojo. Oh. So there's no professional staff coming in to clean those floors and wax things. And so all the that. students really develop an appreciation. Hey, don't mess up this place. I've spent hard work <laughs> getting it clean, shined, polished, making it work. And so they take more pride in their experience there, yep. having invested of themselves. Mm -hmm. That's exactly the idea. Yeah. So it's a, it's a really neat um, uh, sort of idea. Obviously, you wouldn't wear shoes in a place like this. You can mm. see the, the beautiful wood floors uh. there. You really want to, uh, to, to handle that nicely. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, that, that's basically dojo. It's, it's, it's pretty straightforward. It's, it's this big sort of uh, place to practice your, practice your dough, mm. so to speak. So, uh, I wonder what kind of doughs we could practice there. <laughs> Anime dough. Anime dough. Manga dough. We could even do geek archaeologist dough. There we are. Yeah. <laughs> How would they find out more about that? Geek archaeologist. Well, come and check out our website, geekarchaeologist.com. Mm -hmm. That's www.geekarchaeologist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Google it. Google it. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for joining us on this episode of Geek Archaeologist.